doctor, doctor, I need a doctor. Doctor, doctor. There you go, that's for you and you are Michelle, ho, 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 ho. Hey, listen, did you uh, talk to Naomi for me? You can go. Yes, you do one thing, and you can't do it. Hiya. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Naomi, Naomi, Naomi. What are you doing? Naomi, if, what if? I asked you, did you have any plans for this weekend? What would you say? I have, and they don't include you. Why don't you save some of that energy and find yourself a girl who at least thinks you're attractive? Oh, that was good. You see, with your wit, my brains, my brother's cops, baby, we can go places. You like Italian? Italian what? Politics? Football? <sighs> Underarm deodorant? No, food. I hate it. You see, I hate it too. We got something in common already. Let me get this straight. You don't think I'm interesting? You don't think I'm sexy? You think my sense of humor sucks? And you wouldn't go out with me if I was the last man in this hospital named Jackson? That's right. You see, I think all those things too. We were made for each other. Jackson. <laughs> yeah? Get your ass off my desk. This floor is off limits. Okay, that's far enough. What was that? Be right back. Hey, don't go nowhere, right? You've got two minutes to clear this area. You now have less than two minutes. Well, get down! Get out. Serious party. Let's go! Come on! Get out! Let's go! Come on! Smart people run the other way when they hear gunfire, which means you must be incredibly stupid. Or the hero type. Which is it? 
I guess I'm very stupid. Blackwood, Agent Whiteside. Blackwood? Whiteside? Uh, <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> you all alone down here? Well, that's right. Uh, the computers and I have an understanding. They do all the work, and I let them. <laughs> this way. They told me I'd go crazy down here, but I didn't believe them. I like silence. <laughs> know what I mean? No, I don't. Yeah. Ta -da! <laughs> Not bad, huh? This place gets me up. What happened to the heat down here? It's held to clean, though, man. This way. And there you go, gentlemen. Prisoner number 569, uh, Patrick Dixon, architect, crime, murder, sentence, <laughs> life. Life? In this? Man, why don't they just take the guy out back and shoot him? Because death's too easy. It's no return value, right? Right. But a lifetime spent in one of these babies? Your body frozen, your mind still active, forever wandering, never able to rest? <laughs> Hell, if I wasn't so mellow, it would scare the shit out of me, man. I can just imagine. Now, this guy, he just got lucky. Get him up. Anybody got to be here? Nice threads. Yeah, they're all right. How long have I been in? Just 24 months. Felt like 24 years. Hey, I pull guys out after 20 stretches. They gone totally batshit, man. You got off light. Hey, who pulled me out? Beats the hell out of me, man. Good luck, Dixon. Dixon? Hey, my name isn't... Mr. Dixon, Trevanian, FBI. These are agents Blackwood and Whiteside. Have we met before? Uh, no. Why'd you guys pull me out? Look, we don't have time to explain. Uh, we'll talk on the way down. Let's go. Uh, hey, guys. Look, I'm not going anywhere until I know what's happening here. Mr. Dixon, listen, we need your help. Oh, my help? Yeah. People's lives depend on it. Is that right? That's right. Oh, I'm not leaving this pressure palace till I know what's in it for me, okay? Look, Dixon, don't be an asshole. You got a chance here. You can go along with us. We'll forget about the rest of your sentence. You'll be a free man. Or you can piss me off. I'll stick you back in that tank. You can keep pushing your beard up through your chin. Full pardon? That's the idea. When do we leave?
to show a girl a good time, don't you? You should have come with me when you had the chance, man. We could have been chilling out with some queeny white wine. Now look at us. Hey, maybe these guys will let us phone up for a pizza. Just say the word, baby, and I will kick his fat ass. Go for it, Jackson. Quiet. Maybe later. My hero. Somebody get a picture on these things here? We've only got about three minutes. Come on. Three minutes to what? Hey, how about a little hint here, huh? Sir, the president's on the line. Romanian. No, sir, uh, we haven't heard anything specific yet. Uh, we're due to hear from him again in about two minutes. Yes, sir. Right. Yeah, yes, sir. Yes, uh, the architect's here, sir. Yeah, hello? Right. Right. President was asking for me. Well, this is your baby, Dixon. You built the goddamn thing. Now, take a look at this. Does it look familiar to you? Now, we don't draw plans as good as you, but uh, best we could do on such short notice. Well, it's, it's terrific. It's a good effort. But, uh, I mean, you got the scale and everything. Now, the terrorists, they've taken over the top half of the building. They're, from what we can figure out, holding at least about nine hostages. Nine hostages? Why is the president so interested? Well, one of the hostages is special. She's his daughter. Well, listen, you think I haven't got this worked out yet? I'm your star hostage, right? So there's no way you're gonna shoot me. Want some free advice? I think you should get therapy. Let me explain something to you, okay? Because I don't know what planet you people have been living on, but obviously, you don't know how things work around here. You're never gonna pull this off. The minute you walked into this room, you gave up living. But you see, I've never lived. what it is you want. Fifty million dollars. <clears throat> Where the hell do you think we're gonna get that kind of money from? You figure it out. Hey, my man. This guy needs some serious attention. If he doesn't get treatment, he's going to die. We all die. Sooner or later. Bastard. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, you ain't gotta do that, man. You, you ain't gotta do this.
All the stairwells. They're booby-trapped. Uh-huh. Now, they've shut down the elevators here, here, and here. Except this one here. They left it just below the roof. Now, that's our way in. No oh, shit. The assault team go through the elevator into the ventilation system. Then the second team goes in. First team disable the booby traps. The second team take out the terrorists. Yeah, right. The only problem is they may have booby trapped the air ducts too. So when you get up there, you'll be looking for anything that doesn't belong. When I get up there? Yeah, they won't be expecting that we're moving this quickly. Look, 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 let me let me help you out a second here. Okay, I don't want to ran your parade, but uh, why don't you just include me out? Listen here, Dixon. You belong to me now. You jump when I say jump. I'm gonna make sure you disappear off the face of this planet. Look, I'm just uh, an architect, right? Yeah, right. And nobody's asking you here to do gung ho. I don't do gum ho. Now, once you get in there, all you have to do is look at something suspicious. That's right. And if you see anything suspicious... Hey, that looks suspicious. Silent running. This is Bird Dog. We're in position. Roger, Bird Dog. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Get down, get down. Get Dixon, Dixon, get yours. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Charge ready. All right, everyone, head down. We're at the top of the elevator shaft. We're going down. Go, 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 go. Move out, move out. Control panel's been disabled. Gonna try to bypass. Bypass complete. Gonna hook the remote.
brakes down there. Move it! be a file on this guy. People just don't appear from out of nowhere. There's no record on him. Well, keep looking, goddammit. Wait a minute. Something. Subject Romulus, file status classified, restrictive. Access Shadow Chaser personnel only. Romulus Shadow Chaser. What the hell is this? I don't know. Sir? This guy's skin temperature is practically non-existent. There's no blood flow, no warm areas, no evidence of human life, whatever. And his voice is hitting subsonic range. is way beyond the capacity of human vocal cords. I've got something. Project Shadow Chaser. Project Leader Joseph J. Kinderman. Jesus Christ. Kinderman. You know this guy? Oh, yeah. He's head of ATR. ATR, that's... Military research guys. Yeah. Get him on the phone. If Kinderman's involved in this, his shit hasn't even begun to hit the fan. Jesus Christ. Kinderman, you son of a bitch. left i suggest you don't waste them three hours just isn't enough time now we're dealing with a massive political and bureaucratic problem here well i decided to make it easy for you as you can see we have a very sick man here so i've decided to send him down you are very very lucky man That clarifies the situation. Very clear. Trevenian life is simple. You live... or you die.
I don't believe it. Dranian. Dranian, can you hear me? Dixon, what the hell? We thought you were dead. Didn't anybody count the bodies? Shit. Listen. Listen here, Dixon. De Silva. My name is De Silva. You got the wrong guy. It's impossible. Check it out. My name is Michael De Silva. I'm not your goddamn architect. I'm not your goddamn architect. Get a hold of that spaced out dipshit at the prison. I want to know what he's given us here. You listen here, De Silva. I don't give a shit what your name is. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Come on, Trevanian. I mean, I've been in the deep freeze for years, okay? You wake me up, you offer me a part. What was I supposed to say? Sorry, mister, you got the wrong guy. Well, he does have a point. Just get me the hell out of here, okay? How? How? How the hell am I supposed to know? You got me in this mess. Listen to me carefully, Dixon. There's no way that we can come in and get you out at this time. I suggest you hide out somewhere until this is over. You understand? That's your best suggestion. Boy, you guys really got it together. I'm telling you, De Silva. Stay out of the way. If the terrorists find you, they'll think you're one of us. And you'll be endangering the rest of the... De Silva! Silva! He's gone. Killed himself a redneck in a bar and uh, claimed self-defense. And I guess he didn't buy it. A football player. I put a goddamn football player up there. Trigger! 
It's a hair trigger. Don't! Don't worry. I know how to handle a gun. about you. He doesn't care about any of you. You're all expendable. Yeah, yeah, it's me. Let me talk to him. I don't care if he is busy. Interrupt him. Stand up. Up, bitch! Hey, hey where, are you, where are you taking her? It's all right. <laughs> hey, come on, man. You can't be doing that kind of shit. I'll blow your head off. survivor deal with it we'll head him off
Come on. I must have been a real shit in another life to deserve this. <laughs> we got him. He's in the elevator shaft. Ventilation system. Him. God damn you. He's not one of my men. But look, you got my word on that, okay? Tell him your name. Romulus, let her go. Tell him your name. Laura Jameson. How long have you worked here? Eleven months. Romulus. He's not one of my men. Ravinian, <laughs> you're repeating yourself. If I tell you he's one of my men, you're gonna go ahead and do this anyway. So for God's sakes, what difference does it make? Let her go. You know, I have to do this. Hey, asshole. Can you hear me? I'm not a fit. Okay, and then who are you? Just the wrong guy in the wrong place. You don't have to kill the girl. Look, it's me who you want. Why don't you come and get me? <laughs> Look, um, what's the matter? Are you scared of me? I'm up here laughing at you, man. <laughs> God damn you, listen. left. Hey, De Silva, can you hear me? God damn it, De Silva. Are you listening to me? Go fuck yourself, Trevanian. I told you to stay out of the way. Now because of you, we've got another dead hostage on our hands. Listen, you son of a bitch. I think I'm enjoying this. 
Look, I don't know what's gotten into your head, pal. But you sure as hell ain't helping my job any. You're outclassed, Trevanian. Don't you understand that? Well, you asshole. What do you think this is? The first and ten at the Super Bowl? Hey, maybe you need a manual to tell you when you're getting your ass kicked. But I don't. Forget about your pardon, Miss Silva. Not only am I gonna stick you back in the freezer, but I'm gonna make sure you stay there for the rest of your goddamn life. Do you hear me? Same old Trevanium. See your ulster is playing up again. I want all excess personnel removed from the lobby. Excess personnel? What the hell are you talking about? This is no longer a hostage situation. This is now a national security matter. National security? My ass. You think I'm going to hand this over to you and your stormtroopers here? Pentagon clearance gives me authority over you at all times. Isn't that correct, Mr. Trevanian? Isn't that correct? Yeah, that's correct. And remove your men. These two, they stay. <laughs> Whatever you say, Trevania. Whatever you say. Insurance. Is anybody down there? Can you hear me? Who the hell are you? I'm Joseph Kinderman. I'm with ATR. That's Advanced Technical Research. What's the matter? You lose one of your lab rabbits? I understand that you've been giving Mr. Trevelyan problems. That won't happen anymore. I'm in charge here now. Ah, that's great, Doc. I really put my mind to rest now. I run a department called Shadow Chaser, sometimes known as the Romulus Project. Is there any relation to the fruitcake running around up here? Yeah. Your perspicacity amazes me. Now, the aim of the project was to create a perfect synthetic warrior. Intelligent, adaptable, self-sufficient, unhindered by any sense of morality. And Romulus is that creation. An android. You gotta be kidding. This psycho is an android? Android, yes. Psycho, no. His mind is not disturbed. Merely free of the usual social and emotional inhibitions. Well, that's terrific, Doc. Because this guy's stairs definitely do not reach the attic. Romulus is a billion-dollar killing machine, Mr. De Silva. You have no chance against him. I advise you to keep out of his way. And mine. Until this situation is resolved. Come 
I look like a goddamn terrorist? Yes. Well, I'm not. What are you? You cop? Not exactly. FBI? CIA? Special Forces, good guy. They've been fiddling with that computer for the last 20 minutes. They're working on a newfangled hot idea. Beat the android. Yeah, well, maybe they're going to challenge him to a game of chess. Yeah, maybe. Come on, we're leaving. Oh, no. oh boy, wait a minute. I have to change. You don't have any time to that. Well, no, I'm not going out there looking like this. I'd look ridiculous. Okay, you look a lot worse than the morgue lady. Close the door. Please. Look this way. Ready. What is that? I got food poisoning at the French Embassy. This is all I have to wear. Shoes. Shoes. Lose the shoes. What the hell do you think you're pushing? What are you doing? How do you expect me? Listen. Lady. What? Out there, you may be the president's daughter, but in here. You just excess baggage. Oh, you think I'm going to tie you down? Tennis, swimming, track, archery, fencing, gymnastics, horseback riding, and riflery. Now, you think you can keep up with that? Look, lady, I've had a very shitty day. And if you give me any more trouble, I am going to leave you here. Got it? Yeah. Got it. One thing. Keep your paws to yourself. No, thank you. I don't think they'll I'll wear them as you so politely suggested. Smart girl. Silver. Tell him I'm rescuing you. He says he's rescuing me. That crazy gungo bastard's got the girl. Look, De Silva, there's no place that you can go. De Silva! This is Kinderman. What the hell are you doing? Silver is with the girl. Are you crazy? He's not acting on my orders. He's working on his own. He has no... <laughs> Asshole, you're supposed to pull the pin out.
Jonah. Level 38. Now. You pull a stunt like that again, I won't care what kind of clearance you got. I'll bust your ass. Look, I have one chance, just one chance of retrieving Romulus. And I'm not gonna let you or this silver stand in my way. Retrieve Romulus? You slime. You don't care about the hostages. We just want your goddamn robot back, huh? Yeah, that is correct. Just tell me, how are you gonna do that, huh? That information comes on a need-to-know basis. You do not need to know. There's only one guy who thinks you're worth that, and he runs on batteries. My white knight. What are you doing? Catching up on some sleep. I've only had a couple of years. No. No, 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 no. This is not... Why don't we keep moving? Where to? Oh, out of the building. Away from here. All oh, the exits are blocked. You mean this is it? The light at the end of the tunnel? Look, if you want to go out there and get yourself killed, terrific. <laughs> Me, I got a couple more things I want to do with my life. Number four. Football. You were in the Saints playoff game. That Saints playoff game. Right, am I right? You were there. You bet I was there. Right. You were the third string quarterback who ran over 100 yards in the fourth quarter. That was so incredible. Yes, that was a great run. My God, I've never seen that done before. Uh, and, you know, I think they should have really started you in that game. I mean, I knew that you had an arm. I had no idea you had a pair of legs like that. What wheels you were smoking. No, I knew that the uh, first string quarterback... Yeah, but you really should have passed Andrews when you had the chance. What are you talking about? Andrews was covered by Rudge. Yeah, yeah, Stoker. No, he was on the 40. Hartsdale took him down. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Well, are you kidding? You had time to make that pass. Give me a break. Valentine and, and Colby, they were up my ass. What was I supposed to do? Uh -huh. Stand still? Davis, he was smoking up yours. Now, if he'd made the touchdown, you would have been dead meat. No way. I was miles ahead of him. He never would have caught me. Well, that's only because Hal took him down before you made the TV. Well, that's what you call teamwork, babe. Yeah. <laughs> and your timing was incredible. You really, really did it. <laughs> God, what the hell happened to you? So you're just gonna sit around here on your ass? Huh? Tell you what. I'll flap my arms and I'll fly us out of here, okay? 
There are only two ways out. The mm. stairs and the elevators. And they are all booby-trapped. Booby-trapped. They're all booby-trapped. Of course. Why? They'd have to. They'd have, have to what? Come on. Come on. Fox, this is Chicken Hawk. Fox, this is Chicken Hawk. You read? This is Fox. What's your status, Chicken Hawk? Sir, Blackwood. What do you got? We're picking up a high frequency radio transmission. Put it on the speaker. On schedule. Wait for my signal. 15 minutes before pickup. Roger, Fox. Chicken Hawk out. Chicken Hawk. That's an old helicopter designation. Yeah, yeah. Well, it makes sense. A helicopter's the only way they could get out of here. Harris, keep us in post. If Romulus is going to give his pilot an all-clear 15 minutes before he's due to pick him up, that chopper's got to be parked within this radius. Well, there are only a couple possibilities. The dump site and the old factory on the east side. The rest is residential. All right, check it out. We've got exactly one hour to pull something out of the hat. I think if we pull this one off, there's a nice big fat bonus. If we pull this one off, we'll be lucky to keep what's left of our nuts. I hear you. Well, come on, let's get out of here. Trevanian, where are those men going? That information comes on a need-to-know basis, and you don't need to know. chance of overcoming Romulus, but it will have to be done face to face. And the only possible opportunity is during the exchange for the money for the hostages. Yes, Mr. President, I'm quite aware of that. But this will work. I can absolutely guarantee it. Thank you, Mr. President. You won't regret this decision. is on its way. Pardon me. Can you tell me where the men's room is, please? Oh, so sorry. I thought you were a man. <laughs> Come on, lady. Let's not go through this again. Give me the gun. Come and get it.
Trevanian, I'm sending the girl down now. Yeah! You bring her down, I'll buy you the biggest goddamn beer you ever saw. Hey, De Silva, what are you waiting for? No more heroics. You want your part? You get the hell out of there now. You get out of there now. Romulus, this is Kinderman. Kinderman. Listen, every day you get the chance to talk to your creator. Should I be honored? Romulus, you can't win. How oh, can't I? I know your limitations. You can be brought down. Blind optimism. It is such an endearing quality. Why are you doing this? You have no interest in money. I've learned that money is freedom. What was my future with you? A toy soldier? Obedient? Expendable? There's a lot of me in your Romulus. I don't wish to see you destroyed. How am I touched? Or are you concerned with your billion dollar investment? to bring you down, Romulus. And who better to do it than my creator? Or I will have to destroy you. But what if the creation destroys the creator? Now that would be true freedom. There's a better party downstairs. Let's go. I think you can handle this. Nah, but I'll figure it out. All right, let's get out of here. Come on. Come on, everybody. Come on. Listen, I never got a chance to thank you. Maybe we can talk about it downstairs. Let's get out of here. I can see why they had to freeze you.
wissen. Ramirez. Time's up. And I hope for the girl's sake that you have the money. It's here. I've sent down the elevator. I'd like the president to bring it up himself. Are you absolutely crazy? That's not the deal, Romulus. That was never the deal. Mr. President, I'm sure you're watching this. It isn't a difficult choice. Either you bring me the money or you watch your daughter die. Now this diet contains a compound of acid and ZSV. That's a micro explosive. I know what the hell it is. Once injected into the bio stream, the ZSV travels instantly to the cortex, where it detonates. A tiny explosion. <laughs> but a fatal one for Romulus. A sort of uh, android embolism. You've been working on a surprise for Romulus? Yes, sir. It's ready, sir. Mr. President, there's no guarantee that this half-assed thing is even going to work, sir. Speaking in ignorance again, Mr. Trevanian. Gentlemen, at this late stage, I do not believe it serves any purpose in quibbling amongst ourselves. Is this your marksman? Uh, yes, sir. The very best, sir. I hope so. I've discussed with Agent Trevenian. Romulus will not be expecting me, so we can use the element of surprise. It will all be over in a few seconds. Good luck, Mr. President.
may be the last chance I have to talk to you, Romulus. You said that if the creation destroys the creator, that will be true freedom, do you remember? You remember? I remember. Well, now's your opportunity. Are you going to take it? of international appeasement have earned you acclaim the world over. And while you've been busy touting for votes, our enemies have been laughing at us. Laughing at the new America, the soft America. Many of us do not share your vision, Mr. President, so that when you step down from office, you will make a way for a stronger government. One that wants to see this country great again. Step down from office? You are insane. I have no intention of stepping down. Wrong. Looks like you've been shafted good and hard, pal. Looks like we both have. Fox the Chicken Hawk. Come on in. Green light, Chicken Hawk. Come and get us. Roger, Fox. I'm on my way. Fire right there, Hamoud! FBI! Trevanian, the booby traps have been reset. And they're counting down. In 15 minutes. This whole place is gonna blow. Yeah, it is so I know, I know. Pretty good scam you just pulled, Kinderman. You don't know when you're finished, do you, De Silva? Sorry. But I gotta settle something with this freak of yours. Come on, asshole. You could do better than that. Leave him. He's insignificant now. Whatever you say. Grandmother could shoot better than that. And she's dead. What's the matter, Chris Eyes? You need a fresh jump start? Maybe used to be. 
This is one touchdown you can't afford to miss. of amusement. Or try laughing this off, shithead.
someone I'd like you to meet. Research. You son of a bitch. Yo, Silver. 